Hi, it's One Invisible Songstress, and I do have a new song today. The song is called Immorality or Immortality. Is this really a question? And the words in Hebrew will be explained underneath the video. Immorality or immortality. Is this really a question? You get to decide which side you want to be on when it comes to the finality of your life. So what will it be? A beautiful eternity in Gan Eden or Purgatory? You mean to say I have a choice, yes, and you have a voice to you. Spread the knowledge and emet of a kadosh baruch Hu on this earthly plane instead of all the nonsense and superficial garbage that is being fed to the public and then used for indecent purposes as if you buy into all the quote fun and games woe is to you while the Yetzirah is having a field day he pushes you to the brink not in order for you to sink but to propel you to rise above do to shuva and overcome all the temptations that are brought your way by means of the dark side and their devilish tactics but you can turn the tide if you choose to do so it is up to you and only you as no one can force you to live in a certain manner Still you must know oh, it would be advantageous for you to wear the banner, the one that reads Hashem Huaha Elohim Ain Omilvado to show your allegiance to none other than the Bore Oholaham who is second to none. If you are still not sure which way to go, let me take you down the road. On a trip to the Olam Ha'emet, where nothing is left out. Every second of your life's journey is shown. So how do you want to be known? As one who followed in the derech of Hashem and will be given eternal spiritual rewards for it, or to face an eternity filled with shame, sorrow, and pain. How can I be so sure of myself that this is so? Please don't take my high word for it. All I ask is that you discover it for yourself by reading and listening to the personal accounts of those who have had a near-death experience and came back to a physical life to reveal the God-wrenching truth of what they saw in the next world. Like Rabbi Alona Nava, Nir Abu Jam, Esther Saada, and Sharon Nachshoni. I will list their names below the video. So let's get back to what I asked. In the beginning of this song, have you come to a conclusion about which side you are on? As to me, it is obvious, as I would rather bypass and give up the limited and finite pleasure, physical pleasures of this world for what is potentially waiting for me. If I follow the manual of HaKadosh Baruch Hu, meaning the Torah, to a T, -E, even if I don't achieve everything, it is my effort that matters as well. What is that you ask? The indescribable, limitless, and endless spiritual joy and pleasure, and pleasure. So again I say, so again I say, so again I say, so again I say, immorality or immortality, is this really a question? Thanks for listening, One Invisible Songstress.